Match Day is the day that uh, medical students all across the country find out where they're first going to be practicing as physicians. They find out where they're going to do their residency training. In the life of a med student, Match Day is almost bigger than graduation. Everybody across the country is opening their envelopes at about the same time. It just is a validation of all that effort. A process that only happens in medicine. This doesn't happen in any other field. It's kind of the day that we all wait for, you know? It's the day that we all look forward to, that you get to celebrate where all of your friends and colleagues are going to get to build this next part of their life. We're celebrating in Bowling Green, in Moorhead, Kentucky, in Lexington, all across this commonwealth as one college of medicine. This is the first ever match day at the Bowling Green campus, and this just is like a dream come true, finally. It's really the culmination of everything we've worked for as medical students. It's a huge deal just to finally know definitively where we're going after all this. Match Day is just an amazing day in the life of every fourth year medical student. So it's the culmination of their dreams, it's what they worked so hard through medical school to achieve. So today is a joyous and blessed day indeed. I decided I wanted to go into some kind of specialty or career that really allowed me that everyday contact with people. For me it was the pursuit of a big problem. I came from an engineering background and I wanted the problems that I address to be things that actually impact people and make their lives better. I've always had an interest in um, helping others and, and helping others heal. Even when I was in it, it was really hard. I looked forward to that bond that I would have with my future patients. My mom and all of my mentors throughout the years helped me sort of realize that dream of um, going to medical school. You know, every day I get to wake up and make a positive difference in somebody's life. You're the healers. You're there in those worst moments of those people's lives, and you, you can be a positive difference maker. Serving in a rural population has always been really important to me, and, you know, being from a rural area, it's been nice to come back to this area for my clinical years um, and feel like you are providing a service that people really, really need. The thing I look forward to the most is returning back home to Eastern Kentucky to provide care to that patient population. The shortage of physicians in our state in general, and especially in that region, and just hoping to fill a gap. It was one of my inspirations for pursuing a career in medicine. When I started my medical education, you know, putting on my white coat for the first time, this day seemed light years away. When I think about tomorrow, I think my family would be really proud because they know how much work and sacrifice it has been. All the hard work and, and struggles and, and successes through these past four years. We've all gone through these four years together and, and to be with my peers, uh, it's going to be really special. Filled with so much pride and excitement. And at noon they're going to open those letters and you know there's just going to be tears of joy, there's going to be like shrieks of joy, it's going to be great. There are certain phrases that mark the rhythms of our lives. phrases like, I do. It's a boy, it's a girl. I love you, Dad. Yay! Phrases once said, I never forgot. Today, you've experienced one of those phrases. I matched it, dot, 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 dot. You will never forget that feeling. Like one mom said, those envelopes when they open them, that is eight years of hard work and a journey for that entire family in that one envelope. I am so proud to be a part of this class's journey. I'm Match! <laughs> Rainbow Babies in Cleveland! We're going to Cincinnati! <laughs> I've been working for this ever since I was an undergrad and even high school, so I'm finally, finally here. <laughs> it's amazing. It's the best feeling ever. I got my number one. I'm going to Charleston. Kentucky for radiology. <laughs> I'm asked into emergency medicine at the University of Kentucky. I feel like a proud parent of all these students. Absolutely ecstatic. That was my number one. Indiana for transition year Yay! and UK for radiology. Yay! Oh my gosh, all the Woo! feelings. Relieved. Woo, very relieved. I'm feeling so relieved and so excited. I matched at the University of Kentucky Adult and Child Psychiatry Integrated Track. So happy that I matched. This is my number one choice, and I just couldn't be happier today. I think that he'll be truly the best doctor. The presidency, here we come. <laughs> UT Southwestern, baby. UT Southwestern. We, we matched! Match.
seeing them excited about the specialty that they're going into, excited about the potential for their future, just like I am. They're just excited, proud, and truly fulfilled in this journey and in this experience. All the tears, all the exams, the hours and hours of studying have finally paid off. The people in the state of Kentucky is what makes the state special. The people here at the University of Kentucky is what makes the university special. To know that it's all paid off and that we're all going to have these great adventures for the next three to five years is just, there's no words for it. It makes me proud to know the impact that we're going to have in our communities and the impact they're going to make on patients' lives. Go forth into the world and do all the good that you can. And I know that you're gonna go forward and do amazing things in the patients that you take care of, the leaders you become in your communities, and the educators that you already are of the students and residents who will follow you. Just never stop doing those things and know how proud of you we are.